Hey guys, welcome to the DMX Show. I've got some great, awesome news for you today. An exploit was released to root any gingerbread Motorola device. It is a simple one-click root. Uh, the root has not been around. In fact, the Droid 3 has gone three months with absolutely no root uh, for it at all. Our Droid X, we've had to um, install pre-rooted ROMs uh, to gain root for gingerbread on our Droid X. Uh, and the good news about this exploit method is that it should work on the Droid Bionic uh, here in a couple of weeks when it's released on September 8th. So as of today, August 25th, 2011, uh, this one-click root method will work on any Motorola device that runs Gingerbread. Uh, so without further ado, let's get started. I'm going to show you how to one-click root your Motorola Gingerbread device. Um, just so you see that I am running Gingerbread, I'm going to show you... Uh, my settings, about phone, and I'll show you the information here. Um, Android version 2.3.3, and I'm on the latest version for the Droid X, which is 4.5.602. And I want to show you that I do not have root. This is totally stock. Uh, you'll see there's no super user at all here and I'm going to run root checker just to show you that it does not have root okay sorry you do not have root access okay so this phone is not rooted but it will be here in just a minute uh, so in order to root your phone you'll need to go to settings applications and development make sure the USB debugging is checked and then plug your phone into the computer uh, plug in your USB cable. When you see the USB connection pop up, click USB connection, select charge only, and hit OK. Uh, then you're going to go to your desktop where you have downloaded the file that's in the description. You've unzipped it into a folder. Uh, and then what you're going to click here is click to root your Droid 3. So you will, let's see, I will double click that. That opens up the command here and you will just follow uh, those instructions on the screen. And it's telling you to make sure that you install the correct drivers. Um, in the link in the description, there's going to be links to all the current Motorola drivers. Uh, turn on USB debugging like we, like we said and put your phone in charge only mode. Uh, your phone will reboot twice during this procedure. This is normal. Uh, and if you're ready, press any key to start. Uh, running exploit part one of three and you'll just follow the on screen instructions here your phone's going to reboot like I said three times basically the guy that released the exploit um, he did it with 80 it's just simple ADB commands to unroot the phone and this is just a procedure here that expedites the process, makes it easier for people who do not understand how to run an ADB shell for their phone. And I'm guessing this is going to take a while because the phone does have to reboot several times. So I'm going to pause it here and I'll come back when it's finished. Okay guys, so this exploit apparently was made for the Droid 3. Uh, when it says rebooting the phone, it's actually going to reboot it into bootloader mode. At that point, you'll need to unplug your phone, uh, turn the phone off, and then turn the phone back on once you see that it's booting up. Uh, you'll plug the phone back in, and then it'll run through the next step. Okay, so now it says the phone should be rooted. Um, hopefully you understood what I was saying. Um, I ran through exploit part one. It said rebooting the phone. It rebooted my phone into bootloader mode. So from there I unplugged my phone, turned it off, I uh, turned it back on, and when I saw the boot animation I plugged it back in and then the program was able to continue. So we'll go into the phone. Okay, super user request. Uh, we'll go ahead and allow that. Uh, that means our phone has been rooted. So we'll go back into Root Checker and verify that the phone is rooted. 
allow root access. Congratulations, you have root access. And we'll go into the app drawer, and you see the super user is there. So this is how you can root your official over-the-air gingerbread. Um, no more need to SBF your phone and flash a pre-rooted file on your Droid X or any other Motorola device. Guys, check out my website, droidmoderx.com. Hopefully this one-click root will not be patched when the Droid Bionic is released, and I can cover that device for you as well. I do plan on picking that up uh, the day that it's released. So if you like my video, subscribe to the channel, check out, check out droidmoderx.com, follow me on Twitter at droidmoderx, and uh, I appreciate you guys viewing this video. Thanks.